Hey, hey. Spring Lafay, Simply Terra. This is going to be for Patreon and the Patreon viewers. And this is going to be a past, present, and future reading for Element of Air, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. We're going to start with Gemini. Then we will move to Libra and Aquarius. I have got some rose scent going with essential oil. And I have my incense burner going also. Or I've got incense going and it's the bat like goes out the bottom. It's really really neat. Oh, and I love my salt lamp. I'm actually thinking about getting me another one. Maybe a few more. For other rooms in the house. I like to have one right next to my bed also. Okay. Hmm. Gemini. Let's see your past. The King of Wands. Hmm. Ah. Hmm. Okay. Well, we got the aces going on here. Okay, Gemini. I feel like you want a new beginning with someone. I feel like you are having new beginnings in a lot of areas. But I feel like you want a new beginning with someone. I feel there's balance in your life. You have it balanced out. Your person They are balanced and they know their worth. They've got everything together. They're stable, abundant. Juice, you want a new beginning with them. And with our Three of Pentacles, I feel like this is you. I feel like you're very crafty. Very crafty. I would kind of watch as far as ego is concerned. Because I don't think your person will, you know, be in too um, forward with what you have or what you're doing or as far as pentacles are concerned. But two of cups. So we're looking really good. We've got new beginning, new beginning, new beginning, union. I mean you can't. <laughs> That's really good. Okay we're going to get one more. Ha <laughs> ha! Looky there. Looky flipping there. I gotta take one off the bottom. The sun. That's your yes card. Let me move this so you can see. Oh my goodness. This is like totally awesome. Because this means there's a chance this can go forward with this person. Because you have new beginning, new beginning, abundance, new beginnings all the way around, growth. I 
feel like this is growth within this connection. And you've got the sun shining on the whole thing. Can't get any better than that. That's awesome. So, hmm. That is an awesome read, Gemini. If it does not resonate, don't try to make it fit. Check your birth chart. Because this is for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Saturn. And these are timeless readings. So whenever you are drawn to it or whenever it is presented to you, it could be for you. You could take something away. Or you could take something away for someone else that's connected to you. Now, we're going to move on to Libra. Our Libras. Mm, that rose essential oil smells so good. To me, that just speaks love. Romance, passion, feeling cut. You're getting a cut. Hmm. Oh, we got the chariot. Hmm, somebody is making an, an offer of something. They're trying to. We got the high priestess here. Someone's using their intuition. This is past, wanting to move forward with something, present, wanting to make an offer of something, future using your intuition, you know, going within, really looking at things with clarity, ah, because we have the empress here. I feel like this is your person taking on this, this um, energy. She knows her worth. She knows her value. Um, someone may be pregnant, by the way, or going to get pregnant. So, just saying. Um, yeah, she's she's like the mother of, of, you know, nature and and just growth. See all the growth. You have to come to her with a good heart. I'm feeling like you came or you're yeah, I'm feeling like you have came through with something that just was not pleasing to our Empress. But we have strength. Ah. We have strength. But there's a feeling of combated, batted, oh my goodness, yes, yes, combativeness. I don't feel like this is with this person, but I feel like this is around this person. Yes, yes. Ah, oh, but the sun is shining. And if you have a question about your person, the answer is yes. I feel like you're using inner wisdom too. And there can be growth within this because you see that's growth, that's growth. But, combativeness, I can't get that word out straight, I'm sorry. Um, 
I feel like having to feel like you have to oh my goodness what's that word you have to explain yourself you have to it's like saying something wrong without meaning to say something wrong every time that makes sense yes yes You're letting it burden you. But the sun's here, so we need to release this and, you know, not have such a burden. If this is you or your person. This is turning your back. Ah. Somebody is turning their back. But someone wants to make an offer with emotion. I feel like a new approach. Yes. Yes. Wanting to rush in. I feel like you're taking on this energy of the King of Swords. You know what you want. Hmm. Take one from the bottom. Ah. Uh, Libra, there's your scales. <clears throat> Balance. This situation is balanced. So, I mean, it looks like you are going to move in or someone is going to move in towards you or such. Um. We can take another one. Honestly, don't feel like we need to. Hmm. Yes, I do. There we go with that offer again. Rushing in. I also feel reaching out with this one. This is offering. Ha, ah, lovers. Now, this doesn't have to be. I, this. I, oh, my goodness. This could be soulmates or some sort of soul tie. This does not have to be like lovers now. This could have been lovers in the past. You know, past life. <laughs> yes, I know some of you don't believe in that. And um, to be honest with you, I used to didn't. But uh, many things I used to didn't, you know, I believe differently. I don't know. Certain things I'm changed on. That's what I got. There you go, Labor. I mean, it looks good. It looks like a good read. Um, it looks like there's a really good chance that your person could come back with the answer of yes if you approach your person correctly. Because... Your person is taking on the Empress energy, which you want to approach in the right way because this person knows their value and their worth. You go at them wrong, and you're probably not going to get the answer that you want. Just saying. But um, if it doesn't resonate, don't try to make it fit in your life. Check your birth chart. That can explain a lot. Now for Aquarius. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and, well, Saturn. Past, present, and future. For our Patreon viewers, our Patreon supporters, please.
just huh <clears throat> the eight of swords someone feels stuck <clears throat> excuse me oh my goodness the ten of cups hmm mm. five of cups Oh, I feel like that's your person. Yeah. That is your person. Taking on the King of Pentacles. Ah. Oh. Someone feels like they can't do anything. They, there's nothing they can do. What they feel like, uh, yes, yes, it's like I've done all I can. What more can I do? There's nothing I can do. You have to be patient, yes, yes. You have to learn to go with the flow, yes. Live in the moment. I just got that. Live in the moment. Don't look to the past, the past has done been. Don't look to the future, it'll just confuse you. Live in the moment. Look to the moment. Yes, yes. Because this is what you desire. Ten of Cups. Happy family, happy home, happy life, true love. I feel like this... Hmm, is reflecting. It's fine to reflect, just don't stay there. Feeling like you have to fight for what you want with our Five of Swords. And then we've got your person here taking on the King of Pentacles. Honestly, I feel like that's what they're doing. They're working on Pentacles. But, with our full card, the number zero, I feel adventure. I feel having to blindly just take that leap of faith for what you want. Not knowing what's going to happen. Not knowing the future. Just knowing what you want. There's your card, Aquarius. This is a wish. This is a wish. This is what you want. Take a look at the bottom. Ha! Ace of Swords. New beginning. New beginning, new beginning, new beginning. New beginning. I don't really need to take another one. I will. <laughs> someone. Someone is really thinking hard. They are really thinking about someone. I don't know if this is you, Aquarius, or your person. Knight of Wands wanting to come in. Someone is wanting to come in. Ha! Huh. Two of Cups. That is the desire. That is the desire. Look, we've got new beginnings, new beginning, new beginning, new, new beginning, new beginning, new beginning. And the sun is shining on it. That answers your question. Yes. That's our yes card. Question has been answered. I mean, this is like totally awesome. Seriously, this is like, I mean, I do have a feeling though that 
Someone is not quite cooperating. I feel like someone is pondering. They're taking their time and they're thinking. Not moving very quickly. But yet working towards what they want. I feel like this might be your person. I feel like they're working on something. Maybe something in their life that has to be fixed before they can co go forward with you. I'm going to take another one. Death. Whatever they are working on, they're going to be, it's going to be completed. A karmic cycle. This may be a relationship. This may be, they may, somebody may be getting divorced or separated or um, there's something. This is the end of something. But you know, with all endings have new beginnings. Beginning, 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 and our full beginning. I mean, to me it's awesome. I think it's a really, um, I think it's an awesome read. I mean, I want to take another one though. Someone feels like they have to defend themselves. They feel pushed. Someone feels hurt and someone feels pushed. Hmm. This is a reconciliation. This is someone that you've known. Your person is. I don't feel like there's communication right now. Just pondering. Pondering. Not communicating, pondering. That's what I'm getting. Just pondering. But there's, I feel like there is going to be a reconciliation. Just slow movement. Balance. Balance is being brought, you know, with our Libra scales. And I feel like there will be an equal give and take. See how he's equally giving to both. Plus, I have an emphasis on these pinnacles, and then I get drawn to that one. Someone is really working on their pinnacles. Justice is here. Again, the scales, balance. There, to me, something karmic is going to end. Temperance is here. Oh my goodness, I'm drawn to drawn to the crown. This is balance also. This is growth. And then the crown. This is this is guided. Someone is being guided along their path. Maybe both. The di the divine wants you together. You've got all I mean seriously. If we look at, oh my goodness, major arcanas. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is meant. This is meant to be. Take another one. Okay, I feel like, okay. We had reconciliation here is what I was feeling with this one. I also do, I'm gonna to have to I'm gonna to have to emphasize. You see how we have three cups? I feel like that is our third party with your person. This is something they're having to end. And they are being guided. It's being guided. It's going to end because it's karmic. And there's going to be balance. And I feel like this is kind of like with the fool. This is a new, a new, oh goodness, a new beginning. It's like starting fresh. Yes. Starting with a clean slate. Yes. Flipping. I can't believe this. Again. I had this happen so many times in the other readings. 
the perfect pair. The king and the queen. I can't remember who else got... Oh my goodness. See, it's coming. Someone is going to be offering. You two are going to be abundant together. This is going to be new beginnings in not just love. This is going to be true love. This is going to be abundance in whatever you need. If you didn't have much before, I feel like you're going to get what you need. Oh my heaven, look. Emotions and love. This is true love. This is blessings from God. We have got three of the aces here. Oh my goodness. That's all I'm feeling. I tell you, this is awesome. This is so awesome. Oh my goodness, I'm an Aquarius. <laughs> oh well. I don't know who it's for, but it's an awesome, awesome read. And I hope whoever it's for sees it. Because this is unflipping real. We've got so much major arcana. This is divinely guided. Uh, so it may be slow. It it can be slow. It can it calls for patience. It calls for faith, trust that things are going to turn out right. Going with the flow, living in the moment, not the past or the future, but the present. Yep. So. Uh, um, yeah, let me know if you like these, the, this style of the way I've done this. Um, and I will be doing the other elements. We have water left, fire, and earth. So, have an awesome, awesome, awesome day, and thank you for your support. With, you know, the support that we receive on Patreon, I do want to be able to invest in more cards, more, um, you know, tarot supplies. Things that can help me get messages out. Can make it easier. Yes. Bye.